Hey guys, if you have ever had hatched your own butterflies and are wondering what to do once they're hatched so they don't die, which has happened to us before, I'm going to show you what you can do. Um, we've only had one out of our five hatch and we have one is just attached right at the very top, which makes it really hard for me to do this. But what I've done is I've taken cotton balls and I have created my own nectar essentially out of um, about half a cup of sugar melted in a cup of not quite boiling water um, and then add just a couple drops of soy sauce which honestly I have no idea what that's for but it's supposed to help think of it like Gatorade right? Nature's Gatorade. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do is put this inside and I'm actually going to grab my butterfly by the outside of its wings and I'm going to put it onto here. Um, they taste with their feet, so as soon as they have touched this and realize that this is, you know, something for them to eat, they will reach out and they will suck it up right up. So I put about half my solution in here with just a handful so it will last quite a while. The rest of them should be coming out um, emerging within the next couple of days so this should last so I don't have to reach my hands in again once they're all out we'll let them all free but um, yeah so I'm gonna try to do this without detaching this one cocoon that is right on my zipper and I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do it, it might fall don't fall little buddy All right, now my other butterfly, the one that just hatched today or emerged, is at the bottom here. So I'm just going to reach in. And as long as you're careful and your hands are clean, you won't hurt them. You just grab them by the outside of their wings. <gasps> it is possible, I've done it before. Just don't rub them together. Once they're inside, okay, there, he's gone inside. I'm going to show you. Here's just a closer look from my other side of my camera. You can see there, he is just sucking as fast as he can. The hungry is poor little guy. There we go, and he's finished. Curled right back up and hopefully he will live for a couple of days.